Hi folks, Steve here at Boss Trailers. Today we're going to take a closer look at a 2019 Venture RV Sport Track model 271 VMB. A uh, great little floor plan, 30 foot, 11 inch, including the tongue, just a little shy of 6,400 pounds of dry weight, extremely towable. It's an incredible trailer. It's been doing very good in our own yard and also for Venture RV since its introduction in September, it's their best seller. So let's go around and take a look at all of the features that this trailer has to offer. At the front, it's got an electric tongue jacks. You'll get two times 20 pounder propane tanks, they'll be full. Uh, your battery will sit on the rack right here. There's a battery disconnect, beautiful little feature. Stone guard, fiberglass, gel coated front cap with LED lights in them. Around the corner, we have a solar panel ready, so the connection to connect your solar panel right here. It is a one key fit all the locks, so entry locks, your storage compartments, the same key. Magnetic holder as well, beautiful pass-through storage. It is uh, LED lighted and motion detected. There's also a switch that will turn off the lights on the front cap and also the one underneath your trailer because uh, there is four LED blue lights for a ground effect. It's also um, enclosed and heated underbelly. Uh, nice feature, really like that. Rain gutter is with spout extension all around, including the back wall. A very large electric awning you can see goes all the way to the end of the trailer. A new um, entry system for your steps. It's called solid step system. It's beautiful. Basically, it just folds up and it locks in place. What I really like about it is that it is extremely sturdy. Large fold away entry handle. You get a bottle opener dog leash holder, gas electric water heater, uh, patio light, LED as well, same thing with your speakers, there's some LED lights in there, your range hood is vented outside, cable connection, power outlets, nitro field radial tires on aluminum wheels, we have an outside kitchen with a small fridge, two burner stove, and a sink, nice little unit, again Magnetic holder for that. Same key as the main entrance door. At the back, roof ladder, 200 pounds, flip up, flip down, cargo carrier, uh, backup camera ready, cable satellite ready, power detachable cord, black tank flush, hot and cold outside shower. There's even a little rain gutter over top of the slide out. Double wiper seals. Rack and pinion system, the best in the industry. Uh, right here to this little hedge right here, we can see a low point drain for your hot and cold. Nice little steel valve at the end. It's not just a little plastic cap like a lot of manufacturers are using. Uh, just beautifully done. New color this year it used to be in the champagne beige color. Now it's in the white and the gray. Uh, yeah, people really like it. Let's take a look inside. So first thing, <laughs> beautiful hanging closet by the entrance door. All of your monitor panel and light switch are here. And on the other side, a beautiful size pantry with lots of shelf. They actually left the bottom up, you can stuck a couple pair of shoes underneath there. A little bit of extra storage, double sliding pocket doors, light switch on the wall before you get in. While we're here, may as well look at the front bedroom. Uh, true 60 by 80 queen size bed. Uh, taller than normal shirt closet. It's pretty nice, so you're not going to wrinkle your pants. Uh, there is two night table on the back of it. There's a power outlet and a USB outlet. Padded designer headboard, same with the bedspread. There's TV hookups on that side. Two large windows that opens and a roof vent. Uh, there is also a heat vent on the floor and an AC vent on the ceiling. Fully complete front bedroom. What I really like is this, it's not too tight. There's, there's plenty of room to go around. Pretty nice. Now, this is the room that people like. Um, decent sized kitchen, uh, thermal foil counter so there's no edge to worry about. Double stainless steel sink, extremely deep. 
I pull out cab, residential quality, it's pretty nice, definitely an upgrade from what we're accustomed to seeing. Uh, there is a place to charge your phone and your tablet. There's a power outlet and a USB outlet up there. Little hidden compartment, really like that. Storage above, they even included the shelf. How often do you open uh, the top cabinet in the kitchen? There's no shelf there. Well, it is there. Plywood main drawer, ball bearing hardware, a place for your sponge. New stove this year, it's made by Furion, really like it. Flush mounted, bifold glass uh, top. Uh, look at the quality of this, this is like residential quality. Uh, you can turn the light off if you want, it's just a nice little add-on. There's even a light in the oven. Pretty nice stainless steel microwave and so is your fridge. It is uh, bigger than normal, so your standard size 6 cubic feet, this is an 8. So a beautiful unit. Definitely pack a few extra drinks in there. Pots and pans drawer. Right here, fireplace, uh, it produces heat, 1500 watts, so if you get a little chilly at night, you don't need to get the furnace on, you can just get the electric fireplace on. The MFM CD, DVD, Bluetooth, USB auxiliary, also an FC for the, for the people that knows what it is. Uh, 40 inch TV, cabinet above, extremely deep. You got extra blankets and stuff like that, it'll definitely fit there, but there is a linen closet in the bedroom. Uh, high to bed sofa, three fold, extremely comfortable. We don't get to see, but the windows are very large. Windows on the side. Windows by the kitchen, you can see it's extremely large as well. Uh, Freestanding table and chair, there is storage underneath. The sitting, really like that. LED lights in the slide outs, there's no lack of lights there. Uh, there is a skylight with a blind in the living slash kitchen area. Really like that. Uh, the room that people are going to be really surprised will be the bathroom. We'll start with that little room at the end. It is a walk-in closet, folks. A walk-in closet in a 27 foot of box trailer. There's a little dresser. Place for extra shoes underneath. There's a mirror. A light switch on the wall. A power outlet. A few hooks to hang your... Whatever it is that you want to hang. And a couple bars for your shirts and your pants. Folks, incredible. It's very large. Um, two medicine cabinet in this trailer. There's one here or you could use it for other stuff if you want. But there is one. I'm going to let my camera man go around. There is one above the sink. And it's a decent size as well. Your shower glass enclosure stays in so when you're done with the shower the water doesn't come out on the floor. Beautiful unit. There's a shelf to put your Shampoo and soap, there's a skylight, there's plenty of height. I'm five foot eight. I know I could be taller, definitely in this trailer wouldn't be an issue. There is a porcelain foot flush toilet as well. Besi behind this door, there's a very large linen closet. We can take a look at that when you get out. There's a light switch, a power fan switch, and there is a, a particular system called the Level Mate Pro. It helps you level your trailer the first time. So, everybody out. Beautiful linen closet, lots of space there. The extra roll of toilet paper, whatever it is that you need, it will fit in there. So folks, again, very important. Uh, 31 feet, really, with the tongue, and less than 6,400 pounds of dry weight. It's a great couple's trailer. You want to bring some friend camping, so they can sleep very comfortably on there. It's a great trailer. Folks, I think we're done. Thanks for watching.